Here's why Pedro Pascal being cast as Reed Richards, aka Mr. Fantastic in the MCU, actually makes a lot of sense. So ever since we got our official Fantastic Four cast announcement on Valentine's Day, I feel like most people like at least half of the four choices. I mean, the thing in Sue Storm are slam dunk choices. I actually really like Joseph Quinn as Johnny Storm, but the big polarizing choice is obviously Pedro Pascal as Reed Richards. I've seen a lot of people upset about this choice and whether or not Pedro Pascal is the right guy for the role. And to be honest, I get it. But let's start off with the obvious reasons why he was chosen for this role. Two big business reasons. He was already in that Disney pipeline having played the Mandalorian and he's just super popular right now. Everybody's trying to get a piece of Big Papa Pedro right now. So injecting that into the MCU makes a lot of sense. But outside of a few characters, I feel like the MCU is really missing that Tony Stark charismatic role, like the centerpiece for the entire cinematic universe. And I don't know about you, but Pedro Pascal screams charismatic. But does he have the range and the complexity to play Reed Richards, who is a complex character with a lot of range? And as soon as I saw this picture, I was like, okay, if they can capture the essence of the vibe of this fucking art, I think he can nail it. On the surface, Reed is a hero, but a lot of times when adversity strikes, Reed can think like a villain. It has been a villain at times. And it's that moral complexity that makes the Reed Richards character a damn unique one. And did we not just watch Pedro Pascal play Joel? I said there's a lot of subtleties and complexity with that character with a lot of moral gray area. Plus, this clip right here just screams Reed Richards. I bet I could find and show you like the psychotic example, this physical example that I have now that I have to do to learn my lines. What do you got there, Pedro? So this is this like psycho first letter of every gibberish. Oh, I use that 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 you do next to the um actual text. Yeah, like well, no, oh, yeah, and it also helps that he's played a father figure in most of his roles. Playing a father figure opposite of Sue's motherly figure is key and vital to the four's dynamic. Not only to Johnny and albeit sometimes to Ben, but for Valerie and Franklin Richard. I have a feeling they're on the way, and it makes a lot of sense. Oh, and I've seen people complaining about the age gap between Reed Richards and Sue Storm. Pedro Pascal is currently forty-eight, Vanessa Kirby's thirty-five. But I mean, there's been instances in the comics where Reed Richards himself is actually like ten years older than Sue, so I don't really see that as a problem. Oh yeah, and they're uh, acting. Look, I get the hesitation and the frustration. Me myself, I'm cautiously optimistic. Don't ever forget about Michael. Keaton, Heath Ledger, Robert Pattinson, so on and so forth.